Man, I sure love my luxurious lifestyle. I get nice mansions. I get to make fun of poor people like you, Chef. I'm truly living the life. Good for you, then. You know, I've been playing big at the poker tables recently. I ended up winning $700 after spending $3,000 last weekend. Bruh. Wow. I don't care. Anyways, I need to make a couple more videos now for my OnlyFans. Wait, what the hell? When did you stop making videos on OnlyFans, Chris? Ages ago, man. Did you really think I got all this money from Total Drama? Um, kinda. <laughs> I wish, dude. So since I'm broke now, uh, can I join in? My cottage! No, get wrecked. See you later, gay lovers. Chris, are you okay? That is it. I am getting sick of the government blowing up all my precious cottages. I need to do something about it now. Well, maybe if you talk politely with them, maybe they'll reconsider their actions. No, that won't work. Oh, look. It's my old communist manifesto. And now, I just got a brilliant idea. <laughs> Chris, don't tell me you're about to do what I think you're going to do. Jeff, it's time for a total drama communist revolution. Get me the contestants now. They're gonna help me whether they like it or not. I'm so glad no one knows our little secret. I know. You look so cute today, by the way. Morning, campers! Meet me at the beach now, or else it's cock and ball torture for the lot of you. And yes, that includes the woman too. Don't question it. That's a shame. I guess our time will have to come later. I'm glad to see you've all made it here. Annoyed. I was in the middle of making a YouTube video. A YouTube video? I thought it would have been a casting couch video. Anyways, our challenge for today is relatively simple. Simply overthrow the Canadian government and install a communist utopia for me. Seriously? How are we going to be able to do that? Yeah, you must be dreaming, mate. To be honest, I thought you'd be like a hardline capitalist, but I guess you learn something new every day. Here are your weapons! You lot will be helping me today! Man, you know what? Screw this bullshit! I'm not helping you with your stupid little mission! Chris, you're a fucking psychopath! Ugh. What the hell? He's dead. Let's go! Now that's what I call an epic gamer move! So, does anyone else want to disobey my orders? That's what I thought. This is gonna be so much fun! I love causing harm to others! You know, I like the way you think, Izzy. It's very 
evil thinking indeed. Man, I don't know why I'm still here. I was making plenty of money growing marijuana so back weird. home. I thought you were a farmer. Yes, Zoe. I'm a marijuana farmer. Oh, wow. Interesting. Here's my money for the weed, Scott. Smoke weed every day. Anyways, the Parliament Building is a couple of hours away from here. So we're all gonna travel by bus. Here's your bazooka, Chris. Now hold on, sugar. Why do both of y'all get to have bazookas but we don't? Yeah, you need to share the goods equally, Chris. That's a warning shot, bitch! Don't question my leadership again, or else I'm sending all of you straight to the bottom of the ocean like the Titanic. Get on the bus, losers. To the back you go. Something doesn't seem right about this. What the heck is that thing? I guess I'm a ball now. Yeah, so it's best you don't touch anything on this bus. <laughs> Me and the boys had a pretty wild party the other night. <laughs> Anyways, uh, we better get going now. Man, I could really do with some protein powder right about now. Wait, what is this? Oh my god! Holy shit, I'm so high right now. Hey, that was my nose candy! Can you be a bit quieter, please? You can suck my dick, little guy. Oh, I will, in the name of evil. <laughs> Everyone scream as loudly as you can! Gosh, does you really have to shoot at my kneecaps, Duncan? Fuck! Zombie! Okay, that's it. Everyone shut the fuck up! She's right. Save your energy for when we get to Ottawa, okay? You know, I love how nice everyone's being to each other. Why did we stop, Chef? School kids are crossing the roads, man. Whatever. Let me deal with this. What the hell, Chris? It's okay, Courtney. One death is a tragedy. A million deaths is just a statistic. Yeah, well, Scary Girl Dawn, the cops are all over us now, so it's still not good. Okay, I am really excited right now, and I really, really do mean it. All right, then. Let's use Harold as bait. Wait, what? Why me? Well, without the ability to walk, you're not much use to us, Harold. Clearly, you aren't aware of my mad skills, then. I HATE ALL OF YOU! That didn't sound very good. Ooh, my turn, my turn! I've done this once before! <laughs> Great job, Izzy! That was so deliciously evil! Yeah... It would have been nice if she didn't die in the explosion, though. Oh well, our revolution must go on, comrades! You look a little tense there, Zoe. Yeah, I just... miss Mike, you know. I've never been away from him for so long. I understand. I can make you feel a little less tense if you would like. All right, we need to make a quick pit stop. Why are we stopping at a McDonald's, though? Yeah, this is like the least communist place you could possibly go to. Well, me and Chris are hypocrites. Okay, so just shut up and eat your damn McDonald's. This is bullshit. I can't grab my food at all now because I've lost my arms. Yeah, I can't grab my food either. 
either. Wait, where the hell did your arms go, Lindsay? Hmm, oh, I don't remember. Oh, come on! I just wanted some goddamn ice cream! You're seriously telling me the ice cream machine is broken? I will break your scrawny little neck if you don't get me an ice cream before I exhale my final lung again! Alright! Time to die, bitches! What the fuck? Did you really have to destroy the McDonald's like that, Chris? Yes! I did! Just like the way I destroyed your mom! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit. Did you know that when I got Maccas back in Queensland, I would spread two jars worth of Vegemite on my Big Mac? Wow! I didn't know you could speak Spanish! Chris, do you know if there will be any zombies when we arrive at the parliament? What's with your weird ass obsession with zombies, Sean? Hey! You better back off him, Heather! <laughs> you seriously gonna try to use a boomerang on me? Ah! Get. Me. Out of here! Okay! Did you really have to throw him out the window like that, mate? Okay, don't speak up. Got it? What the hell did I do? Ah! Oh, that is so satisfying. Well then, that was quite the fall. <laughs> Sean, I'm so glad you're okay. Damn it. I got a massive headache now. Did you get thrown out of the bus too? Yeah, Chris is a fucking maniac. Indeed, it's probably for the best we got thrown out of that death bus. So, we've made it to the parliament building. Now what, Chris? Drop your weapons and get your hands up now! You've been swept on all sides! <laughs> I have a tactical nuke! You can't stop me! Wait, did he just say tactical nuke? Yes! I did it! Chris McCanada is mine! Don't you mean Canada? No, I'm legally changing the name of this nation to Chris McCanada. Named after me, the myth, the legend himself. <laughs> Man, this is sweet. Can I be second in command, Chris? I've already taken that job, punk. Which one of you just tried to shoot me? I believe that it was Noah who tried to shoot you, our glorious leader. What? That's a total lie. Max was the one who tried to shoot you. Okay, you didn't need to shoot both of them. That's kind of a dick move. Okay, I don't have a reason for that one. I just found her kind of weird. The rest of you, come with me. Why do I feel something brushing up against my leg? Sorry, but now that my old lover is dead, I really want to send for you, if that's okay with you, of course, my queen. Sure, go for it. It's your loss. Yes! Nothing else matters in life now! Alright, campers, I just heard from an anonymous source that one of you is a traitor. Not cool, dudes. Um, we all know that the so-called anonymous source was probably from Courtney. I would totally never do such a thing! Okay, yes, I did snitch. Alright, we have to figure out who the imposter is then. Among us! Yes, and according to my calculations, Duncan is sus. Oh, just because I'm a criminal now, you think I would be a traitor too? Um, I mean, ex-criminal... <laughs> oh, fuck. Duncan. I wish I could fly into the sun like that. It would so 
will brighten up my day. Now, I have to announce the second part of your challenge. The Canadian Air Force is about to drop 10 tons worth of bombs over here. And so the first person who is able to defeat them will win themselves individual immunity. Screw that. I might be stupid, but I'm not an idiot too. The winner also gets to suck chef's toes. Never mind. I'm definitely doing this challenge now. Shabang! And everyone just died. Great. I managed to survive, Chris. So, uh... That one. I don't know, but we need to get out of here. Hey, Chris. Look what I found. What is that? How the hell should I know? I think this might be a time portal or a time machine of sorts. <laughs> the winner also gets to suck Chef's toes. How oh, the hell are they? Wait, are you two from the future or something? 30 seconds from the future to be exact. Now don't let lightning do the shabam! Wait, why don't you want me to say shabam? And everyone just died. Great. Oh, fuck this. Let's time travel somewhere else, Chef. Wait, I want to come too! <laughs> Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I'm in the back rooms? Okay, I need to get out of here now! Hi! I've, I've been, been waiting, waiting for you, you Chris. Chris. <laughs> please don't hurt me, Dave! I just want to get out of here, please! Hmm, only, only if, if you accept, accept my, my deal! deal. And what would that be? Well, well if you want, want, I can I send you send back, back in time, time just, just before you murder me. me. If, if, if you don't, you kill, don't me, kill me, I'll let, I'll you, let go. you go. Fine. Sweet! Sweet. Now don't, don't back, back out of the, out of the deal, deal or, or else. else. Man, you know what? Screw this bullshit. I'm not helping you with your stupid little mission. Chris, you're a fucking psychopath. Yeah, you know what? This is a bad idea. I'll call the day off. Oh, thank goodness. I was not ready to die today. Yeah, that challenge seemed kind of dangerous. You know, technically I'm a lesbian if you think about it, Zoe. Gosh, now I'll never get to show off my fucking mad skills! Speaking of fucking, let's get back to making out, Noah. <laughs> <laughs>